What's up, team? Hustle don't stop. Is I don't want it. Want it? Eight o'clock at night. Not this one. Why? So it's been rummage through all day. Let's go see if we can find some money in here. What is going on Flippin' Fam? This is your boy Mr. Flipper coming to you with another video a little bit different. Today we're going to go to a TJ Maxx and a Ross I think. And I'm going to do a full recap of every, almost everything that we bought at the Ross for sure. But the main focus of this whole entire video is to do a subscription giveaway. You guys have been so kind and so supportive uh, of me. Oh, right quick. This one's got 143,000 rank, right? When I was out there shopping, picked it up for eight bucks. But now it's at 9,000 selling for around $28. So still a good pickup. So congratulations for being a part of the video. <laughs> Uh, if you subscribe to me, what I'm going to do is do a giveaway for a pair of shoes that I found over at Ross for uh, I don't know, 30 bucks or something like that. But I wanted to give it away because I didn't know I don't sell shoes, really. So I'm going to show you at the end of this video exactly what I'm going to give away. Literally about to check out and just saw a shiny Godiva coffee, truffle, we'll check it out. Like, well, let's see. They're nine dollars each. Nine plus nine is eighteen. So for a two pack for thirty five dollars. So eighteen six dollars profit. Just off of these two of this. I think we got too much stuff today. A lot of um beauty products. One eternity later. Okay, now it is whatever time it is later that I spent in Ross. I... So when I said that I don't sell shoes, it's not like I don't sell any shoes, but when I got these, I just don't know or feel... I don't know, whatever. I just figured that that'd be better for a giveaway. So they're on my shelf ready for you guys to go. So if you are a subscriber, go ahead and mention down in the comments below the word shoes in any kind of way, whether you say, I want some shoes, I need some shoes, or let's get some shoes, like that song. But yeah, uh, I haven't seen you sold on eBay, but maybe they sell uh, on different platforms. I don't know. Either way, it's a good giveaway. Uh, but next, we're going to go over everything that we have bought in the Ross and all the prices we pay for everything that's selling on amazon or ebay stuff like this so, so my wife found this these are nine dollars each and we're selling them for 25 dollars and i think it's profiting us about six dollars for each one of them we got four of them as you can see uh so yeah there it is five bucks profit off of each one next thing is a phone case and this one hasn't sold yet but i'm selling it for 20 bucks should profit about seven dollars so double your money this one I've already sent in and already sold uh, $9 here and it profited me $11 off of a phone case, which is insane to think about, but it's happened. Uh, the next item, I've picked up like three of these. I don't know why I keep picking them up. They're not making big money, but you know, three, four dollars. I haven't sold any of that, that specific one yet. I have this listed on eBay in a couple of pairs uh, for 25 bucks. That's the average price it's going for around right now i uh, have this this one listed inside of amazon should get about four to five dollars for that one these next two are almost the same thing progenic hyaluric acid something for the face it's supposed to double your money on both of these products now these next items these psds i didn't know that they were super cool i guess but every time I buy them in cinnamon, I make $13 off of each pair. It doesn't matter what size. I have small, mediums, large, extra larges, you know, just everything else in between. But each pair sells for $30 and I profit um, $13 off of each pair every time I send it in. Uh, this next thing are right, some soap. I just kind of bought it because I got ungated in Dove recently. So I figured, hey, why not send them in? But uh, the butter shea ones we couldn't send in, and so we ended up just using them for the house. Uh, my wife found this item 
rice exfoliator smoothing something i don't know quick four or five bucks profit off of those again the wife with another save hemp lotion or something face peel off. oh peel off mask yep uh bought them for four bucks not only got my four dollars back but profited four bucks so like 200 percent roi so it's really nice these i don't even know what they are to be honest with you but wife picked these up as well and we're supposed to profit uh six five six dollars off each one of those as well now these are really cool because they're so small and i don't even know what they do but um buying for four dollars selling for 14 and again they'll be a money type things and these are selling regularly this one was absolutely crazy because they have a whole bunch of different brands and they had these on clearance for some reason sealed factory se but these are selling for some of them are selling for 17 but this particular one uh we're profiting five bucks off these a digital thermometer found these at ross as well on sale for 15 bucks but profiting ten dollars off of both of them so that was an excellent pickup i have a bunch of these from a different rosses but i have them lotted up on ebay for 20 yeah 24 dollars free shipping got a couple watches on it i figured i'd send them out but here's the shoes that i'm going to give away like i said it looks like they're from that movie uh coco because they have the skeletons on the front and stuff like that but they're adidas i looked them over it didn't have any issues whatsoever nothing going on i did the test i turned them sideways front ways still has a tag on them i don't know why they are on the shelf to be honest with you i think they're a size nine and a half so again if you did uh you are a subscriber go ahead and put it down in the comments shoes and in my next video i'll do a random comment picker so make sure you tune in for the next video and that's it for today so it looks like we're going to end up profiting about 250 dollars from this haul which is really nice we're only in there for about 30 minutes so until next time guys